The guy that didn't like to fight sure is putting up quite a fight. Alright. I guess we I guess we can finish this and then we can do the final chapter. It doesn't take that long, it's just, it's just a pendulum fight without gigantic guns and shit. I don't know what the end of the section. Sort of. I mean, Max is just, take, Max is just taking a long time <laughs> opening up the goddamn door. Exhaust. <laughs> Sure, he's traumatized, but I don't know. Okay, <laughs> bye. Thanks. Blasco, fucking hell, that you making an entrance? Listen, Blasco, she's taking on you. Fucking hell. Oh, he's about to get <laughs> fucked, man. What's Trisha pleading, right? Yeah, Blasco, there's one helicopter still on the ground in our hangar. If you hurry, we can take a look, get our people in. There's that television in the ground. Well. This guy's crazy about his shots. Kill yourself. No, uh, there's another Nazi on the right. I really don't. That's that's the reason why I don't like them. Is that they just they just they're unrelenting and they're just relentless. Like, did you see how fast he was shooting those goddamn yeah. shots? Whoa, 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 whoa. Could not compete with that. Saved my life. I could prolong the episode by reading all of that dialogue, but I don't really want to. Of course, two of them. This is gonna suck. I think you got him. Oh, yeah, I did. Wow. My room. Wait, wait. Why is this giblet just exploding in midair? I think it's suicide, it looks like. Huh. Milo and his life. Yep. How about no? Yeah, they are. They're just like pushing forward, pushing forward, dead. Just die. Please. Dynamo. Dynamo. What the fuck? It's a soccer reference. Houston Dynamo. I have no. I don't. Yeah, whatever. Hey, it's Tekla. Hey, remember when you were asking about Tekla for some reason? How did you arrive? Everything in accordance with the numbers. This day, the number of consequence is 19. A prime, why not? For the math to square, each and every one on our side must defeat 19 on theirs, on average, and then we'll win. I've been proficient with what you taught me. 11 in the stack. <laughs> Did I thank you? I can't remember if I thanked him, should thank the man that is my friend. But I have accumulated an additional 7 through other means prior to this day. I'm on the move. I need to find Fergus and Caroline. You should come with me. And violate my model. The model is loyal to universal causality. You ask me to rebel against the laws of nature, don't you see? The road in front of you is long and so hard, I wonder how you will cope. Mine is at its end. On this day, I am glad to have found my friend. Good. Alright, bye. I knew somebody was going to commit suicide or something. <laughs> She goes down fighting. 
she got 13. Technically 20. Oh yeah, because you had the 7 that she said she saw it the previous day. Fuck. Hey, Blasco. Should be one entryway to the hangar through a sewage tunnel. I think. Be careful, like. This place is brimming with the ugliest fucking Nazis you've ever seen. The shrapnel guy. Those guys, like I said, those are my least favorite guys. Why do you say that? Just because uh, they're difficult to maneuver around. You're gonna get hit by them no matter what, pretty much. I think that's the last. I think that's the last. One here. See, uh, yeah, Fergus is gonna be in a bad spot, and I have to kill the dog protecting him. It's, might not get it on the first try, but you know, we'll get it. We'll get it eventually. Yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hey, you got it on this Caroline, obviously. Hey, I told you. We, we told Fergus to give the armor to Caroline. Something yep. that's it's not see problems here. Try not to get Fergus killed, please. He's out of ammo and essentially. Why don't you help? What's she saying about him? She's a little puppet, and she finally got that stupid armor back. Cool, not cool, not cool. I mean, I, I didn't get it on the first try when I tried it, but you know. Put on your tea sandwich, you made it! Fergus, hi Fergus, how you doing? Boys, we got work to do, people to save this. Okay, whatever you say, man. I'm getting, on the, I'm getting on the helicopter. So that's gonna do it for um, this episode of Inside the Old Blood. If you like this comment, not dot com, well, uh, if you like this commentary, uh, uh, uh be like Max Haas. Save one of your dying buddies. Unless they have cancer. Well, well, cure that and then, then, then subscribe. Um, anyway, let's let this cutscene roll. Then. Oh, I'm
back when I started. I do believe this is what you call a fantasy blast quest. Or he's just trying Dragon to give his brain a break. Like yeah, see. Wake Dragon up to reality. Sometimes, truly, it's good to remember what you're fighting for. It's tame. From what we know of Death's Head's compound, prisoners are kept on the lower levels, close to the experimental labs. Uh, our timing needs to be perfect. We have the nuclear decryption keys now. Come in deep. Surface real close to the compound. You fucking pulverize the outer wall with the cannon. Get inside the compound as fast as you can. They'll be returning fire, so we'll need to dive again before the U-boat gets gubbed up, after which we'll pull back to a safe distance. When you're inside, get down to the lower levels. Free the prisoners. We send in his helicopter. Once everyone is safely in the air, we prime the nuclear warheads, fire the atomic bombs, level the whole site. Bibo Benno, no more death's head. Be safe out there. Don't fuck this up, you magnificent cunt. Don't fuck this up, you magnificent cunt. <laughs> Make sauce. You too, buddy. Alright, so that's going to do it for the second to last episode of One Stanley New Order. Thank you guys everybody so much for watching, and we will commentate this, this game for you in the next video.